That's the last time I let you choose a vacation spot. I wanted to go to Bora Bora. Lush tropical beaches, lush tropical women. But, oh, no. The warthog wanted to go ice fishing in the Arctic Circle. Oh, I'm so cold. I could... I could sit by a nice, hot, roaring fire. <sighs> now, this is the ticket. Excuse me, is this your fire? Oh, no. We just found it. Yes, it's ours. Get your own. Mm. Your fire, eh? Well, I'm Smolder the Bear, and I make sure there's no forest fires. You see, forest fires are bad. People who start forest fires are bad. I eat people who start forest fires. Eat them? Tell them, Joey and Susie. We played with fire. And boy, we learned our lesson. You have a door in your stomach? Well, Mr. Smolder, we certainly don't want to start a forest fire. That's better. And don't let me catch you playing with fire again. Or else. <laughs> Playing with fire is bad. Never mind the fire. That bear has a door in his stomach. Sucker! My fire! What have you done with her? Why we put it out? Fires are bad. Come on, Pumba. Let's get out of... You two Putin heads will get me my fire back or else. <laughs> Where are we going to find fire? Here in the forest, at this time of day. I had to ask. Come on, we should just forget this whole thing. The bear said that bringing fire into the forest is against the rules. I don't like it any more than you do, Pumba, but if we don't bring back fire, Frenchie will kill us. Now, come on. Already, Pumba. <laughs> What's that you're carrying? Oh, this! <laughs> A flaming torch, wouldn't you know? <laughs> but uh, we've, we've got a good reason for having it. There is no good reason for bringing fire into my forest. But please, <laughs> amuse me with your reason. Actually, it's for someone else. I... Okay, okay, you caught us. The fire is for, well, it's for to, uh, to walk on hot coals. Uh, you see, we walk on fire. Yeah, for meditative purposes. You see, we are, uh, we're swamis. Isn't that right, Alu Gobi Pumba? Uh, right. Tenduri Timon. My uncle was a swami. I always wanted to see that. Let me see you do it. Walk on the fire, that is. That was very relaxing, was it not, Alu Gobi Pumba? Oh, yes! Quite a peaceful experience, Tangeri Timon! Mm, impressive. But I'm telling you, there's still no reason good enough to bring fire into my forest. And if I catch you two anywhere near fire... <laughs> 
down the hatch with you both. Hello, Gobi Pumba. That was possibly the stupidest thing we've ever done. Yes, Tangerine Timon, I agree. Hey! You there! You promised me fire, and it is where? Oh, you know, it's funny. We we just had it, but we dropped it here somewhere, and we're uh, we, we're looking for it. Phew! Well, find more now. Wetting makes me trace angry, hey? Kick off, you hoses! <laughs> Convenient. Um, we're stuck between a pyromaniac and pyrochondriac. What do we do? I don't know what those things are, Timon, but I've got an idea. Timon, you get to be the fake fire to distract the bear while I take the real fire to the crazy lumberjack. Now there's a sentence you don't hear every day. Shh. Here he comes. Act like fire. You've got to be kidding. And lo, I am the mischievous and toasty spirit of fire. <laughs> I bring warmth and light to all. Oh, ain't that sweet? But there's only one thing I do with fire. That's it. I'm gonna eat you. Like you have fire, no? Hmm, you smell quite good. I wager you taste better than this silly fish, eh? Out of the frying pan? Right back into the fire. Hey, Pumba. Yep. Say, Timon, why didn't you let me tell the bear the truth? Pumba, sometimes it's just easier to lie. I see. Gonna hit us with that big shop thing! Hmm. Well, 
Looks like you two fellas aren't so bad after all. <laughs> now, as for the real firebug. Let go. Hey, Timon, guess it all turned out okay in the end. Huh? For us, anyway. So, what are you in for?